The purpose of the following module is to develop a pipeline pilot protocol to display a bar chart using dashboard collection. In this tutorial, we will build a bar chart depicting average rating per beer company. We're going to build on this protocol, which reads a beer.txt file into a delimited text reader. Dashboarding components can be used with components from other collections. On the Favorites bar, click the Basic Statistics by Category component to add to the delimited text reader. The Basic Statistics component calculates statistics for each set of records defined by a specified category. Indicate the category in the first parameter, that is, Company. In the Statistics parameter, select the statistics to calculate. Next, select whether you want to use all the properties found on the first data object or if you want to use a list of properties. In this example, you'll use a list of the property rating. To display a bar chart on your dashboard, double-click the Bar Chart HTML5 component located in the Components tab. The axes represent properties from your data file. In the Parameters pane, Set the X property value to Company. Similarly, in the Parameters pane, enter the Y properties value as Rating underscore Mean. Add a title to the bar chart. Next, from the Components tab, add the Dashboard Viewer to the end of the pipeline. Run the protocol to display a bar chart. Many of the dashboarding components are sub-protocols. For example, the dashboard bar chart component is a sub-protocol. To customize the display of the bar chart, double-click on the bar chart component. You'll often find a component called High Charts Chart. A number of this component's parameters will control your dashboard output. In this example, you'll change minimum and maximum values for the y-axis. In the Parameters pane, click in the y-axis and set the min value to 0. Similarly, set the max value to 5. Return to the top level of the protocol and run the protocol to view the desired change. In the next lesson, you'll change the display and layout of your dashboard.